It's the end of the year and everyone's getting ready for holidays. But do your employees know what the holiday schedule is like at your organization for the end of this year and into next year? A lot of times companies will say, oh, we'll wait and see, we'll wait and see. The problem with wait and see is that time off really can be a great benefit for employees. It's time that they can go and recharge. But a key part of that is knowing exactly what that time off looks like. Because to give employees a surprise day off at the end of the year isn't as welcome when employees have already tried to figure out their own schedule. When am I going to do holiday shopping? When am I going to get my kids from school? And so if it's last minute, a lot of times employees look at that and think, well, it would have been great to know that a few weeks ago. So now there's still a few weeks left, so the time between Christmas and New Year's can be a really dead time for organizations. And so you have some decisions to make. One, what time are you going to give off? As you look at the calendar, what days are you going to give off to employees as holidays? Hopefully you've published that, but it's amazing how many organizations still haven't made that clear. So think now, and you can ask employees, do you know what that time off looks like? And be clear. Two is, do employees have to use PTO during that time? Ideally, employees know the answer well in advance so they can plan out their PTO during the year. I've worked with organizations that have given that time off during the holidays and given it, not required employees to use it as PTO. And some organizations will say, oh, well, then employees just get a bunch of extra time off. And that's true. And they generally really appreciate it. I've had employees talk about how meaningful it is that they didn't have to, you know, worry when their kids were sick about using that time off because they needed to use it over the holidays. So if your business is quieter at that time of year, giving that to employees can be such a welcome benefit. Because the reality, if employees are working, they may be popping in for some FaceTime or checking in on Teams, but they're not really working and productive. So honoring that and giving them that time off can be really valued. Other questions are looking into next year. It's always a great time to look at what your calendar looks like and think about, are you giving things off like Martin Luther King Jr. Day, Juneteenth, a lot of those holidays that are recognized and really important to show commitment to diversity, are you giving that time off? If not, can you change your calendar to show that you're with the times? It's always a good time to rethink what you stand for as an organization. And giving that time off can not only be welcome times for employees to recharge, but to show your commitment to a lot of things that you may have on your careers page or values written on the wall. So now is a great time to look at your paid time off. Make sure employees know exactly what that schedule looks like in a few weeks. Think about whether you're going to require employees to use paid time off or give it. And for those employees that need to work during that time, there may be customer service facing folks, IT, finance closing out year end, recognizing those employees should have some substitute time off they can use. And also what can you do for those employees during that time? Can you provide food during that time, a small bonus, a thanks, have executives come in, some sort of recognition that those employees are often sacrificing when the rest of the organization and what can feel like the rest of the world is taking time off. And then finally, looking at your calendar for next year and thinking about things. Are you requiring employees, for example, to work the day after Thanksgiving? And if it's not a time when you have Black Friday sales and things, can you give that day off rather than make employees take PTO? Giving that time off can be one of the biggest wins you can have for an organization. But giving employees clarity around that is even more important.